you're looking at the servo and control horn for the rudder of my fin wing penguin. The servo rod normally connects to this control horn using this plastic piece. Almost looks like a little wheel or tire that you screw and mount that servo rod into place. You can get a feel for how that works. This is the elevator and the screw goes right into this plastic piece that kind of binds that rod into place. But you'll notice also on the elevator, this guy has cracked. Well, I guess what has happened is that I put a little bit too much pressure and then over time, that tension has caused this plastic piece to break. What I've gone ahead and done, I printed an identical piece with my MakerBot Replicator 2 using PLA. And I've received several questions over the past couple years asking, what's the durability of PLA look like? So let's go ahead and do a comparison. So I have my trusty hammer and I'll give this just a little tap. And you can see that it has now shattered. So really nothing scientific about this test. I'm just going to hit this PLA. And you can hear that I'm definitely hitting it with a lot more force than I did this other piece. And I'm going to hit it with a lot more force than I did the other. And then you can see how durable that is. And now this piece isn't actually threaded. I made the hole small enough just so that I could kind of self tap and then thread into it. And let's just give this a quick test. I'm going to hold the servo. I don't have it fixed yet, so I'm just going to hold it in place. The rudder seems to be working nicely. Definitely feel much better about that control horn piece than using the standard plastic that it came with. More dur durable. Now it doesn't need to be incredibly durable in the air. It just needs to have a good hold, but I'd hate to have one uh, crack and lose a flap while I was in the air. Now we have our elevator. And I've also printed one for each wing. So I have four of these in total. And here's a quick time lapse of the print. And it took five minutes to print. So pretty basic part, but I wanted to share mainly some of the durability aspects because there have been so many questions about it. Now, like I said, that was nothing scientific to throw down the hammer, but I definitely feel confident this will be good enough to perform well in flight. And I hope to do my Penguin Maiden soon. Be sure to share my results. And until next time, thanks for watching.